Food matter circulation is a long-term goal. It's a grand dream, and it's not only for us, it's for the whole world, for a sustainable world. Brunel Center for Advanced Solidification Technology, BCAST, is an academic center focuses our research on solidification of light metals. Our research covers a wide range of activities, from very fundamental research from atomic level activities, to more applied research like uh, processing technology, and to industrial applications. At the moment, we have over 85 people working in this place. We are currently the largest UK solidification group, and one of the largest in the world. We work with a number of academics across the UK and across the world. We also work with a large number of strategic partners in the industry. Currently, nearly all the metals is from mining, extraction, metallurgy, and metal processing, which is very energy and time-consuming, and which causes lots of environmental damage, particularly through CO2 emission. However, if we recycle metal, utilizing what we already have after the first usage, only costs very little energy, normally about 5% only. Our idea is, in the future, we only use secondary metal, which will be enough for us to circulate. We take a lead of the world towards the campaign of full metal circulation, but we need collaboration with academia, with the industry, and with government, with the whole society. Our focus has been on the automotive industry, and we work with OEMs, the tier one suppliers, tier two suppliers, and we work closely with Jaguar Land Rover to realize their full aluminum car with uh, increasing the recycled contents. And we work very closely with uh, Consalium, one of the largest aluminum supplier. We've had a long relationship with Professor Fan and his team, certainly working on solidification research programs in the past. And then we've taken that a step further in recent years and have developed a, a much closer collaboration, which has uh, ultimately resulted in establishing a university technology centre at Brunel University, which comprises two facilities. The Advanced Metals Casting Centre, which actually for Constellium includes a DC casting capability and an integrated extrusion press, where we can prototype uh, full-size extrusions using our new high-strength 6000 alloys. What will be coming shortly is the Advanced Metals Processing Centre, which then allows us to take the extruded profiles and actually make full-size components. We can actually do industrial scale castings or extrusions. We can actually do the prototype on site, so we can do all the troubleshooting for our industrial partners. My research is developing lightweight magnesium alloys for applications in automotive or aerospace type applications where weight is actually very important or in personal electronic applications. My other research interest is understanding structure property relationships in light metals during solid state processing so you get these really fine nanoscale structures and I want to understand how they form and how they affect the properties. I use a lot of advanced characterization techniques like electron microscopy, whether it's scanning electron microscopy, transmission electron microscopy or high-end advanced transmission electron microscopy or even atom probe. We have really good characterization facilities and we have lab scale facility where we can do small casting. We also can do processing at lab scale. Good morning. Good morning. The Liquid Metal Engineering Training Center is the educational arm of BCAS, where we can tap into a huge resources of expertise, infrastructures and research facilities to provide a unique learning environment to train the next generation high caliber scientists and engineer specialize in the field of metallurgy who will then make a significant impact in our economy and societies. The course is designed to empower the student with the fundamental knowledge in metallurgy and the latest thinking and practice in advanced solidification and casting technology, as well as to develop their skills and attributes such as research, entrepreneurships, leaderships, that are required in future careers. Because is innovation. 
This is a really specialized center involved in many um, projects with civil partners and I thought that this could be a good chance to focus my study in a really up-to-date field. I expect to achieve not only a deep and solid knowledge about solidification and liquid matter engineering, but I'm hoping to gain the right tools to move my first step in the working world in some industrial companies.